Welcome back to another YouTube video. Today is going to be an actually pretty quick video, so we're going to kind of try to do two simple ones for this week. So to start, we're going to do the Sentinel spawns. This is going to be episode one. We're going to release the other one in a separate video. That way it's more controlled. But this is going to be how Sentinels spawn out of this little thing. Now, I have this as a vehicle. All right, so first off in vehicles, we have our Sentinel emitter. Uh, we have it labeled center emitter. That's more so if you want to script it to close this back after it spawns it in. Since it's a vehicle, all you would do for the script is just unit close, and then you would label what it is. Um, so I already have it as closed. If I didn't have it as closed, well, I guess it wouldn't change unless it was already open. But we're going to go in here. So we already have our Sentinel squad just right there. In here, obviously, we have our Sentinel aggressor. You can put that in. But here we have emitter vehicle. And then we have it selected. So which one is going to be chosen for where this guy is going to spawn in? If you don't have it chosen, it's not going to spawn quite like that. But I do find it very interesting the, how easy this actually was to do. So. And there you go. Just like that, it spawns in and everything's going to be working. I mean, it, you can add it so it moves and whatnot. But that's how you would get the sentinels to work. And then you can script it so after you spawn it in, you just unit close. And then you have it get the vehicle from starting location or get the vehicle from getting the object. Hope that helped for you guys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.